when using Adobe Acrobat 9, uh, the quickest and easiest way to keep an eye on your document is to move to the left hand side and click on this area here which shows your pages uh, and you'll be able to see what student work is up to and where you are in the documents. Uh, the other thing to be aware of with your comments is that to quickly get to all your comments you can just click your comments and it will show you the comments as you go along, sort of like a little comments area. Uh, I'm just going to minimise that at the moment and go up to Comments and choose Show Comment and Markup Toolbar. And that brings up this particular bar here. Uh, just to quickly add a comment, um, all you need to do is, the first thing I like to do is highlight my area. Uh, and in this case here, if I highlight that particular area there, uh, and then I can also add a sticky note, if I like, to the area here. Uh, great job. And the other cool part I like is to choose the options area, go down to properties, uh, and choose a tick. Uh, once again, if you have a look through all these areas here, you can talk about the different things that a student might want to include in their work, and choose OK, and minimise. And I might also want to go here, and once I've done that, click another sticky note with the area I might say the properties are uh, an area for improvement improvement needed and I would obviously put more information in here uh, you can now see I've got my two areas I can move those crosses around once I've completed that if I want to check all the comments that I've currently made I can come down here and have a look and I can see all my comments I can also choose expand all uh, and it will give me all the information there once I've completed that I simply save the document uh, then I can email it directly to the student or upload it to my virtual classroom.